Hi, welcome back to Thomas Turner Fishing Antiques. Today we're talking carved fish. These particular species we have here have been carved by a gentleman called Nick Podolsky. Sadly no longer with us. So what that means is, for all the wrong reasons, they have moved into the collectible market immediately. These are beautifully hand-carved fish based on the originals. So when someone has caught a trophy fish, they would take it to Nick and he would carve it. Um, and we have a mixture here of uh, male and female arctic char, we have a bass and we have an arctic grilling which I would have loved to have caught, that's a beautiful fish. So if you look at the paintwork on it, very detailed, has all the spotting, all the fins are individually painted and has a, a painted eye. They're mounted on a variety of boards, this one is on a beveled edged uh, flat board and these two are on a natural uh, wooden board, almost log cabin style to them. Beautifully presented fish, beautifully carved. So if I just show you them briefly and run through them, Paul can give us a hand. Can you give us a hand just take that? Oh, very funny. <laughs> very funny. Take the fish. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Good lad. <laughs> uh, just look at the paint coloration on this. This is fantastic. It graduates down from the dark green to the cherry red, the sort of red that we love to see when you pull in a char on the end of the line. Again, beautifully present, even down to the carving of the teeth. I mean, they're actually sharp inside there. This is a great representation of a fish. And if I can give you that one again, Paul, with the right hand. Thank you. Moving on to the bass. And it's typically grey and, and black colours. They do, of course, of course, change colours depending on the river and the, the river bed that they're on. Chasing a little fish, which is quite nice. Uh, that's, that's, I think, a lovely thing. I love this natural effect to the board on it. It's, it's not carved in any particular way. Again, um, lovely fish, lovely paint detail. The same with the grayling. And your price mark on these, you're probably somewhere in the four to five hundred pound bracket. When they go on the website, they'll be going on shortly. So if you're viewing this video of some age, have a quick check. They may or may not have sold. And finally, just to show you a whopper, if I may, Paul, um, he also carved some much larger fish than that. So I can lift one of these things in. This is the... This is the record rainbow trout. Rick has carved. 24 pounds. It's absolutely massive. Uh, again, beautifully painted. The detail is absolutely amazing on it. If you can see that in the close-ups, all around the gills, the peck fins, the eye painted in there. Again, teeth inside. Beautiful fish. Slightly more money. It's a lot more carving involved in this. But check out the website um, to see if these are still listed. And importantly, of course, if you have fish, either carved or cased, which we'll come to later, give us a call. We're always looking for good specimens. Um, a good photograph would help and pick up the phone and either email us or pick up the phone and ask for me, John Stevenson. I'll be the guy that talks to you at the end of the phone and see if we can do a deal on some fish. Good, catch you later. Mm -hmm.